Hi, <clears throat> this is Rocco and I'm in the company of St. Michael and his cars by Doreen Virtue. Michael's cars are very beautiful including um, in the back cover because um, they are shimmering in a like his hairdo. He is, seems to be very connected to um, Joan of Arc in the sense of um, understanding um, uh, <clears throat> a female <clears throat> beyond what most angels are more prone to do. So we will draw two cards today and I will give, with divine permission, uh, instructions to combat the devil as my um, duties in the spiritual world are manifold and not um, necessarily understandable uh, by all uh, right now, but they are for the highest good of all, for sure. So. <clears throat> Michael is saying to me that I have sense of little Modi's most sense of humor. It's amazing how Doreen Virtue's cards are being translated in um, every language. And see, I'm not going to reveal it, but he's got he's got um he's got a thought for uh, a message for uh, an angel of Venus. And uh, that's Hanael, and that shows how uh, the it's it's really a lot of texting back and forth that these um, beings that should be hired by Nokia are doing because it's all about talk, 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 and not only they give messages to us, but they give messages uh, sometimes between each other as everyone has got their own sensitivity so say one knows how to um, grow carrots and the other one knows how to grow um, apples and the other one uh, doesn't know how to grow but knows how to harvest uh, and so on and so forth so each angel helps and cooperates although they've got a whole vision like you do only thing that um, they have it um, at an awareness level while you have it at a subconscious level because the subconscious is something that um, exists and um, <clears throat> in demonology uh, Leviathan is associated with the uh, subconscious and um, it's quite Freudian because it symbolizes that something that hides um, sexuality and at the same time is um, unclean. But the devil derives uh, power from untidiness sometimes, although he's very organized for what concerns him, because he's pure ego. And on the other hand, in the angel kingdom, um, Saint Raphael could be the angel, uh, is the angel that we want to associate to psychology and the subconscious. And uh, it's a different symbology because it's um, a um, talent to be discovered or a potential to be unleashed. And um, still, both um, symbols are greenish. And um, green for Raphael, and they have to be, um, they have to be uh, sought beyond what they appear. So, um, first card for today that Michael wants to give you is that you're safe and protected. Um, this sounds almost stereotypical today to say that Michael is protecting you, but um, really it's not. Um, it's not something that you should take for granted because, and that's the first concept against the devil today, 
that I wanted to share with you because it's during that moment when you um, lose your focus these days that uh, the devil gives you that sense of lightness that um, makes you um, give out um, undersell the sanctity of Saint Joseph in those two principles that mean uh, wisdom in the application of children towards study and concentration and secondly the uh, teachings of uh, teachings of art to young men and these points can be developed with the archangels uh, one uh, Hanael second um, um, Asriel and third um, Baliel or something like that um, anyway Michael is very splendid uh, in this um, <clears throat> in this um, drawing um, he's telling you to uh, rely on the help of uh, life and uh, on the help of the angel angels so rely on God and rely on the angels and although uh, white is not his chosen color and um, he appears almost ironically as a Roman God with um, a white vest because uh, white is the color of his friend Gabriel and uh, uh, he wants to give you something very um, um, simple but very effective that um, is no it's no great news because Gabriel is the angel that brings uh, forth awesome news like um, for Christians and Muslims the birth of Jesus and um, others so um, by wearing his clothes it means that um, in truth he wants to spread the message that all angels are equal and um, said from his point of view that is particularly shining then um, it's certainly uh, again a sign of um, being humble um, whoever drew these cards is a good painter I think and they um, they drew them um, in some sort of um, prehistoric uh, setting and his wings are um, goldish meaning uh, kind of like my hair meaning that um, he, he never forgets who he is which um, is something to meditate upon so um, this is the first card of the day you can rely on the help of spirit to make it interconfessional uh, some spirits, um, Mary is whispering like the devil in my ear saying that I um, can't really rely on the devil because um, the devil is um, slippery and I'm um, adding so uh, she says that it's, it's of course um, a good translation to say that uh, we can rely on spirit every time but not all spirits are equal so um, they're equal in dignity somehow but uh, the devil and uh, Brahma these days uh, for the next two years is something that uh, we um, as humans uh, uh, should not rely on for reasons that uh, she'll explain to you or she'll send uh, Saint Joseph to do so or an angel so um, second message is to be kind uh, with yourself. So, si gentile con te So, be kind uh, to yourself and with yourself because when you are kind, uh, when you are kind to yourself, uh, then um, at the same time you don't need uh, the easy trade of Lucifer. Because Lucifer um, gives you the easy trade, meaning uh, he gives you something you don't want that eventually you want, 
and uh, you thought at that point you lose your point because this light is still too bright and <clears throat> It's all about following his enthusiasm, and uh, his alchemy is powerful. So at the end, um, you end up not um, not um, not being kind to yourself because um, you were taking care of yourself in a gentle way. When one is dedicated to uh, the devil, meaning when one has um, was lost his soul by uh, giving it to him uh, one of the things that you notice is that he is uh, restless so he um, has achieved like a Zazel great technique but um, it could be the same technique of um, a bright angel that's still in the heavens only that um, uh, there's less uh, the quality of um, the dream that surrounds uh, the angels of light that is um, fluffy and beautiful. So, uh, meaning, um, it, the devil is less poetic because um, an angel would have the same um, outcome in words and effect of the devil but um, it um, the devil makes it clearer clearer because uh, you don't have to reason upon it because he's done the reasoning for you but um, <clears throat> he takes away that time um, from yourself uh, when you meditate and uh, this is something that um, like seeing the iteration of Joe Satan doesn't tell you that actually the devil does not want you to meditate on what you're doing because um, Lucifer himself and Saint Raphael would confirm that um, her life purpose is to be a medical doctor and by pretending to be a witch um then um she's lost the uh ability to meditate on what's most important her life so in truth uh all this um propaganda about meditation is really something that ought to be looked uh from a different different perspective and um What should I say? Um, so we said uh, Michael wants you to give, uh, wants me to give two messages for uh, humankind for the ones who are watching this video. And um, again, I'm looking at the beauty of the back of these cards. And be kind to yourself. Si gentile con te stesso. And rely upon the help of God and the angels. Uh, conta sull'aiuto di Dio e degli angeli sono i messaggi dell'arcangelo Michele so these, these are the messages of um, Saint Joseph or Saint Michael all saints and all beings are um, with the same truth uh, first name that comes to my mind is Buddha when I think of this concept but um I don't know who was the graphic designer who was decided that his statue is trendy, but out of this sin we um we gain greater perspective of uh, a lot of things. So um, Eve is with us, and she wants to tell you that she is sorry for Eve. I mean the second woman. She is sorry for having sinned and having um, practically uh, killed uh, humankind in terms of having given uh, Jehovah the possibility to um, give people death. But um, she says that uh, more things will be revealed so that her position uh, will not be as um, bad as um, people could make it look. So, um, to make a long story short, 
the first teaching of Michael today is to um, never um, lose hope so always uh, and never lose the knowledge of the connection to God that brings uh, salvation because this is the main knowledge and through that knowledge all knowledge and secondly is that you have to be um, secondly is that you have to be uh, kind to yourself so uh, take a moment before saying yes to the devil sometimes you can say yes but take a moment and meditate um, at least um, take four to five to eight hours and see if that decision is something that you really feel at a deeper level that your instinct tells you that it's fair to do and if the answer is no tell the devil to come back uh, during the next Easter or next year so that um, the fruit of his thought uh, will have given uh, will have given um, something or rather not so um, the devil has to um, always give something to uh, mankind because um, it's at the same time man for him is a temptation but um, when one is tempted um, one does not um, think straight and when that happens um, impulsive acts are committed so impulsive rather than instinctual and this is something that he wouldn't want to do but uh, you know what um, Tenderness is for the meek and the devil is strong so uh, with that in mind I want to um, Leave you with a few more thoughts by st. Michael who's saying to me that he is with you at all time He is with you to be uh, around you and he is with you to be um kind to be um, is with you to be kind he's with you to be um, rapid and he is with you to be amazing all these words you want to meditate upon and you want to show yourself what yourself is able to do done so uh, one thing is to um, get three oranges at a market and slice the third lemon into four pieces half strawberry se siamo visti bye now